Hello and welcome to the channel. This is Kyla's Theory. Today we will be discussing more profound hidden symbolic messages behind Balenciaga's creative director, Demna Gavasilia. Can one wonder, was this a planned exposure? Please pay close attention to previous statements Demna made about his creative inspiration and ideas. Okay, y'all, it's time to break this down. Now, Firstly, in his personal message, he states, I want to apologize for the wrong artistic choice of concept for the gifting campaigns with the kids, and I take my responsibility. It was inappropriate to have kids promote objects that had nothing to do with them. What I find ironic here is that this statement is conflicting with a statement he made in GQ magazine, which states the following. He states, everything he does, he has a reason for what he do. From the trashy prom suit or a unreasonably expensive bag. It did not just accidentally slip into the collection without me super consciously putting it there. We see here that he is a very deep analytical thinker when it comes to his artistic creative visionary that he is trying to put out to people. It, it does not happen by mistake. He is aware of, the, of what he is putting into his imagery to the point that he states, not even from a conscious perspective, he stated from a super conscious perspective, meaning that he is paying very, very close, extreme detail to the vision in which he is creating. Secondly, pay close attention to this as seen in his personal message. He states, as I would, I would sometimes like to provoke thought through my work. Okay. He want people to think about, you know, he's, he's creating an image. He's showing these visuals and his aim is to have people think through his artistic approach. Whereas, you know, someone write, you know, they're writing a story, you're trying to create a vision in the reader's mind that comes to life. So likewise, within his work and his visionary, his artistry, he is doing the same thing, which states in his post that he liked to provoke a thought through his work. Furthermore, he states, I would never have an intention to do that with such an awful subject as child abuse that I condemn. Now, one would question, then why do it? Okay, what was the rationale for doing it? You know, he, he, he is kind of contradictory here. He states that he liked to provoke a thought through his work, right? So when you saw the ad and the disturbing details and clues in the background, that is to make an individual think he's provoking a thought. Now the question of the day is why, what is going on here? Furthermore, this is conflicting with a statement that he made in a Vogue interview, which stated fashion to me is a mirror, a reflection of what's going on around us. This is manifested in the collection. So again, he already stated, he likes to provoke a thought through his work. Seeing into something is a reflection. You're, you're looking in and hey, this is what's coming back out. A reflection to what's going on around us. Now, with all this in mind, my overall theory is this. Always three sides to a story. Your side, their side, and the truth. Now, could Demna perhaps been sending a message out to the masses, a warning exposing the higher elites? As he stated, everything he does is for a reason. He know, he's very super conscious. His work mirrors what he the vision he was trying to put out there, and he wanted to reflect it back into the eye of the viewer. However, on the contrary was this simply a sick ploy for the mentally disturbed now, let me be very clear the ad without question shows evidence and a painted picture right in front of our face what was going on behind the scenes 
but we can confirm that Demna Govasali is the creative director of Balenciaga, an artistic visionary with a leadership or that does not care what others think. This is contested in his statement in GQ magazine for he states the following. Do I know that this may not be understood by the average social media critique? Yes, I do. But do I care? I'm pretty sure you know the answer. I just do fashion and I love and enjoy it. It's really as simple as that. With this in mind, only God knows the full truth. However, what we do know from the words of Demna himself is he stated, fashion to him is a mirror, a reflection of what's going on around us, which is manifested in his collections. All right, y'all. With that being said, this has been your girl, Kyle's Theory. I'm very interested to hear your thoughts and opinions on this topic. If you want to see more videos such as this, be sure to like the video, comment, or subscribe to the channel. This way, I will know if the information is resonating and I will continue to build on this platform. As always, heads up and shoulders back. God bless.